Hi, this is Luke from MGN, and today we're going to look at Little Big Workshop. What is it? It's an adorable little tycoon game where you manage workers, you build a factory, you work towards projects. It's a lot of fun. We're going to go through what the heck is it? How do you play it? What's the goal? Where's the fun to be had? You want to learn about Little Big Workshop? Stick with me. You will now. Little Big Workshop, as the name suggests, is a factory simulation and resource management game presented in an adorable, chibi-like art style. It's brought to the world through its developer Mirage Game Studios and its publisher Handy Games. What sets LBW apart from the rest of the games in the genre is that it's not really made for the challenge, but for those who enjoy the genre, but at the end of the day do not really feel like having their APM tested. It's for what games were once made solely for, relaxation and pure enjoyment. If the cute little characters running around weren't an indication of this, uh, and the presentation wasn't enough, then listen to some of the soundtrack, watch some of the gameplay, and you will quickly come to understand that Little Big Workshop was made just to put a smile on your face. Let you live out your endeavor as a factory tycoon with the world in your palm. Your goal, it's pretty simple, just be better than the competing factory. The bad guy will try pretty much everything to make you go under. He'll undersell you, he'll flood the market with your product, he'll come to your house, he'll kick your dog, so, with your superior factory nuance, you'll try to mitigate his meddling and up, end up with the more successful business. What's fantastic about the game is that you have options. You're going to have your little worker dudes happy and be less focused on productivity and profits. Just have an aesthetically pleasing work environment that anyone would be happy to spend their days inside. Well, go ahead, you can do that. However, that's not going to meet your factory simulation standards. If you want to turn your hand at being a malevolent leader of the working class masses, that's where the evil DLC comes in. That's right, it's called the evil DLC. <laughs> Charging money to allow the player to a fully appreciate corporate greed is like the purest and most funny form of irony. So what does the evil version add? Well, I'm pretty glad you asked. You get the option to compete against other companies to see who can make the most dosh, much like the main, like the main game, but whilst also running your workers down the seven steps of grief into a dark pit of work-induced despair. You get to play as the antagonist, basically, from the main game, which is pretty cool. You get more recipes for items to build, your little dudes get a little evil makeover, there's more skills, more schemes, pretty cool. So if the relaxing that comes from running a little workshop isn't for you, you want to rule the corporate world with an iron fist, well you can play either way. Look, either way, Little Big Workshop is out now, it's a lot of fun if you want to give it a go. Uh, the DLC is only $15 Australian, and if you love the game or you hate the game or the DLC pack, let us know. Thanks for listening.